Hi, Sarah Jacobs here. Today we're talking about a popular question for a lot of clients in New Jersey, and that's whether their divorce can be denied. It's really important to define what the word divorce means in that question, because there's a big difference between having legal standing to file a divorce in New Jersey and whether the relief that you request from the court as part of that divorce will be granted or denied. Let's really dig into those definitions. Standing to file for divorce in New Jersey means that you meet certain requirements. Those requirements include either you got married in New Jersey or you've lived in New Jersey for at least one year. If you got married in New Jersey and you no longer live in the state, but you haven't lived in the state you've moved to long enough to qualify for their residency requirements, you still may be able to file for your divorce in New Jersey. As long as you meet the requirements, when you file for divorce in New Jersey, you have to do so under what's called grounds. There are nine different grounds in the state of New Jersey, some of which are fault and some of which are no fault. The most popular ground to file under is known as irreconcilable differences, and it's a no-fault ground. It means that there are a series of acts which happen between you and the other party, which you can't get past, and which prohibit you from being able to live together as spouses moving forward. Let's recap. As long as you have standing, and as long as you file under the ground of irreconcilable differences, your divorce can't be denied. There may still be things like custody, support, and equitable distribution that need to be determined by the court, but that's called the relief that you're requesting. And yes, that may go one way or another, depending on the different types of legal support you have and the facts that you can present to the court. So there's a big difference between whether your divorce can be denied based on requirements and standing or whether the relief that you're requesting will be denied by the court. Let's go backwards a little bit though. We talked about standing and the fact that if you have it, there are nine different grounds you can file under. What if you file under one of the fault grounds? Let's talk about that for a minute. Let's take imprisonment for 18 months or longer. If you have standing and you file under that count, you will actually have to prove the grounds you're filing under to the court. You'll have to make sure that you can prove the date of the marriage, the date that your spouse was incarcerated, the fact that that incarceration lasted for at least 18 months or longer. And if your spouse was let out of jail prior to the time that you're filing, that you guys continue not to live together as spouses. So it's important that if you file under fault grounds, you can meet the factual requirements. Otherwise, your divorce can be denied on those grounds. It's important that when you file for divorce in New Jersey, you talk to an experienced lawyer so that you make sure that not only do you meet the requirements, but that you also have the facts to prove the grounds that you wanna file under. This is especially true if you weren't married in New Jersey, or you might not have lived here for a year, or you've moved out of the state and you still wonder whether New Jersey is an appropriate place to file. An experienced lawyer is going to be able to help you with that fact analysis and answer all of your questions so that you make sure you file the right way in the right place. Another popular question we get from a lot of clients in New Jersey is whether their divorce can be denied if their spouse doesn't want to get divorced. The short answer is yes. As long as you have standing to file, you file under the proper grounds, your spouse doesn't have to agree. They may make the process a little bit more difficult and they may slow it down, but ultimately the court does grant a divorce as long as you meet the requirements. The good news, our team has been helping families like yours get divorced in New Jersey for decades. We know the right questions to ask and we know the right way to file, whether you're here or elsewhere and whether your spouse is on board or not. So when you're ready, we're willing to help you too. We look forward to talking with you.